you know, it wouldn't be uncommon to walk into the studio and Todd be, you know, dressed in some Italian dress shirt and, you know, Armani pants and like Italian leather shoes and just like hashing it out with oil paints. Like no one in their right mind would have thousands of dollars worth of clothing on and then just like barbarically be painting. Um, but that would be Todd. Um, and then you might show up at some other point where, you know, he's there, it's the middle of the summer, it's way too hot and he probably doesn't have hardly any clothing on. So you just don't know where you're gonna walk into. Just this past month, getting ready for the show, we've talked a lot, we've joked, we've laughed. He's such a fun guy, I absolutely love him. He's the happiest artist I know, and he's got so much to say. And I really, I really appreciate his sense of humor with art and his just freedom with it. I guess I would have to say that my favorite experience overall with Todd has just been the process of getting more involved with his work in since I'm in constant communication with him, um, really getting uh, to, to know him better and to, to see his vision, to see the things that he puts together. I mean, he, and he's somebody that lives art. He, it's nonstop, whether, whether he's painting, uh, if he's not painting, he's teaching about it. When he was in grad school, we, I went up to see his show, his the, senior thesis show, and it was just, you know, it, it was at RIT and we were in this big gallery and then lots and lots of people and all the other seniors had their shows as well. So we were going from one exhibit to another. But the day before I had been helping him set it up, he had, it, it was really a series of pieces. Um, it, was an, it was an installation and he had this giant cross on the wall and then, a, a, and then like a red, carpet going out towards the cross and then other things standing it was called brazen idol so it was about advertising as as a religion um, but at some point i just sat down in it and it just felt like a church it felt like i was in that church environment and and so that's that was fun it was a fun experience i have the opportunity to bring my students back to cal u once a year to experience painting and other mediums but the students who take his painting class uh, always have really fun and great, wonderful experiences and come back and tell me about them and want to go back. Everything with Todd was like, go bigger, challenge yourself, try harder, dream more, you know, bigger ideas. So I think that that's the way that Todd influenced me the most. My favorite time with Todd is when I walk into the studio and he comes alive. He, he, he shares life with me. He makes me excited and thrilled. And, um, you know, I, I will have forgotten how exciting life can be and how, how wonderful life can be. And then I come in and he's got these ideas and it, and it just generates something in me and I go away and I feel like I've been blessed again. I've been reborn somehow and that there's so much that's possible and that I'd forgotten it. And that's, so every time is my favorite time.